Welcome everyone. This talk is about light sheet deconvolution and fusion using SVI's Huygens software. This movie shows a chicken embryo where 12 tiled and rotated views were stitched and fused together using Huygens. Light sheet images suffer from a number of image degrading effects, often more severely so than other microscopic techniques because large and dense objects are being imaged. Examples are blur, noise, scattering of light and shading, when the object or specific parts of it are not transparent. Light sheet images typically result in large files. Some microscopes require de-skewing of the images. In many cases, the object is imaged from different sides and multiple rotational views should be combined into a single fused image. These challenges are taken care of by the deconvolution and fusion tools in Huygens. Huygens deconvolution automatically takes into account different modes of illumination and sheet geometries. Also, it takes into account both spherical aberration along the optical axis and the variation of the point spread function with the thickness of the light sheet. Therefore, many models of light sheet microscope, including the most common commercially available, as well as custom built ones, are supported. Huygens also supports different configurations between illumination and detection, and it can correct for non-ideal alignment of the light sheet with the focus of the detection objective lens. This shows the effect of deconvolving a mouse blaster cyst image. The movie is a rotating maximum intensity projection where the left part shows the original image and the right part shows it after deconvolution. The deconvolved image on the right shows that the background is removed, the contrast is improved and more details are visible. In the fuser tool, Multiple rotational views can be combined. The tool works in an interactive way where the views can be approximately aligned manually and their relative position and orientation will be fine-tuned automatically. When the images are aligned, the best parts of each view can be combined into a fused image. The single fused image of this piece of moss is rendered on the right. This animation demonstrates how the interactive alignment works. The dataset consists of eight views of a Drosophila brain, rotated every 45 degrees. Different colors represent the different input views. They are not related to wavelengths in this overlay. The image that is shown in red is the reference view. The image shown in green can be positioned over the red image with the mouse. When they align correctly, the combined image becomes mostly yellow as expected. In this way, the views can be added and aligned one by one. Deconvolution can be performed on the input images before they are fused from this window as well. There are several options for specifying in which way the alignment should be fine-tuned and in which way the data from the input images should be combined to form the final fused image. A few preset combinations of these options are available in this window in a single mouse click. The tool will give an estimate of how much memory will be needed to perform the fusion with the currently selected settings. The automatic fine-tuning of the orientation and position of the input works both with and without fiducial markers, and the process will be aided by GPU acceleration. Thank you for your attention. If you would like to have a free trial of the software, please visit our website. We are looking forward to telling you more about Huygens Deconvolution and Fusion in the demo session on Friday. See you there.